I have made some bad mistakes in my time, but that breaks, and I bet I've had way more fun than you. Well, hello there, and welcome to another exciting episode from Bissoff Online. I am Bissoff, and this is me playing Minecraft on the Minecat server. The IP is in the description. If you have a moment, go ahead and click that subscribe button, and if you're up to it, give a like or dislike on this video. So here I am on the Minecraft ser cat server. Um, I don't know how many of you have seen a video before, but I will try to put a picture of what my area used to look like in the description or add it to the video right here. So uh, I get bored real easy and I decide to tear my area up and make something nice out of it. I originally found an area, it was just a mountain, and I put a little tiny house on top of it, and I made a trail up to it to make it easy to get to, some steps. Then I planted a few trees down below, and then I started uh, mining out under the little house and building my area. As anybody playing the Minecraft server knows, they use a golden shovel to cl the claim land so you only get so much area. And I didn't know that the more you play, the more you can claim. So I thought that beginning claim was all I could have. So I'm trying to squeeze farms, houses, animal pens, and tons of other stuff in one tiny little space. You know, like 15 by 15. Now I've got all this. You know, I've got this huge area claim plus more. So originally I had a mountain right over here, then I put that tiny little house up there. Then I built these steps, and they actually came way out to here, because the mountain came way out to here. Then I leveled it out and made all this sugar cane, and I made this village over here. Now I'm taking the entire mountain away. All I've got left is what's inside there, and that's my house. That starts out on top my house. Over there, that long section there is my storage area. Next to that, this area coming up here, made out of cobblestone, is my spawners. I've got uh, skeletons and uh, zombies in there. I've got quite a few of them. Get it's really pretty fast. And then I got neither ward, and of course, this is part of my. Uh, uh, storage system there then up there. I've got Loading finally is my golem spawner It falls down into this little area here. That's fenced in straight into the house Then below that I've got a farm For carrots potatoes and wheat and below that I've got a chicken thing set up for eggs and below that Is animals and they're actually animals are way down there. They're at ground level or just a little below and what I'm going to do is I'm going to build these pillars all the way around then I'm going to glass in the whole area then I'll make a level for each one and redo all this get rid of all this excuse me ugly dirt and ugly cobblestone and everything and it'll just be glass and stone brick then everything will be see-through and since the server is uh, protected I don't have to worry about anybody coming along griefing anything. I don't know what I'm going to do with this giant tree. I love my giant tree. I made it and put a tree house in it. I think I might keep it. Can't world edit it and drop it down to where it belongs. So I think I might just leave it exactly right where it is. And maybe not do anything with it. Just leave it right where it is and all these trees be gone. I may tear my spawners out and remove and relocate those. I haven't decided yet because next to my spawners are my is my area where I do my uh, enchanting and such. So those those towers are going up in the air there. And they come down to my experience there, and there's all my chests. And I've got a hole in the wall back here because I'm. Built, I had to build my wall in such a way because someone's got a claim right here. I should have it moved, but I don't really care. But I didn't have enough room to put my wall in, so I had to move all these chests. Not happy about that, but still going to do it. 
So we're going to have to change all this. I got it. I'm going to keep these guys where they are. I think I'll keep the storage where it is, and I might move the spawners out of the way and increase my storage and have it go across this back wall and along that wall. That way I can get like 150 chests of storage in. Right now I've only got like 80. I don't need 150, but that would catch all my overflow if I ever needed it. So let's get back down to where we need to be. I've actually used to go up and then out of here and then down the steps. But since this is a long trip to get down there, now I can go all the way down to the bottom. Where is it? Oh, yeah. I guess I did. I've got regular farms. Whoops. Our sugar cane farm and pumpkins and melons, which I don't really need. And this is where my chickens are in here. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then down here is my animal farm and cocoa beans. I forgot to replant. <clears throat> and this is just below ground. Here is a level that I'm going at. It's 65, not sea level. I like 63 for sea level. That's where I should have it, but I don't feel like doing it that way. So what I'm doing right now is cooking up a bunch of glass. To make my walls with and that's what we're going to do right now is make the walls but i won't be doing that on camera because that's really annoying and nobody wants to see that so i'll come back as soon as that is finished so this is what i've done so far i've got the front section done i got a couple doorways put in i got a little mistake there not really a mistake or anything but i've got a villager farm going on inside and they drop villagers from here and they fall straight down into that hole and go way out to my village over there but i've moved it I'm, well i'm going to move it so excuse me that now it will fall just behind this pane of glass into the new hole that i'm going to put here and then i'll be able to shave off all that crap in the front that doesn't belong that way it'll be good plus i'll get rid of these stairs and this will be my entrance here and here. And this whole area will be open underneath here. I've got to move my chickens. Give me more room underneath. I don't like where they're at anyway. So then I'll go along and find each floor and put the floors where they belong. And extend them all the way out to the glass. I can't decide what I want to do with this though. Should I have it just sticking out in the middle of nowhere like that? I might just come close to it and then glass it in in that section that is there. But I don't. I haven't really decided what I want to do yet. So for now, I'm just going to do two sides, get the floors where they belong. And uh, see, I may have to cook up some more glass. I don't know how much I've got left in here. Whoops, wrong chest. Yeah, that might be just enough to finish the far side. But we'll find out. Well, that's it for this video. I'll make more videos on the Haphazard Way, so check back often. Or you can check, subscribe to the channel, and follow me on Twitter to get updates when new videos are released. Don't forget to hit that like or dislike button just for the shits and giggles. And as always, later, Minecraft freaks.